on the T side already, and it's a 1v1. Wakeful versus Elixir for this pistol round. Elixir oh. creeping close and a great adjustment onto Wakeful to secure the first round. I believe that was a 1v3. I think so. I think you're right. Look at that. Three kills there. 69 HP. Nice. A little bit of... Oh, and look at that. A little bit of... Got the timing right off too. Towards the end. Yeah, exactly. All right, but... These they get bombed down at least, so they can at least invest something into this. What will the CTs bring out though? Looks like we got two rifles, rifle. three SMGs. Only two rush kids. mid, rush mid. Oh, it looks like that is what the spaghetti decide to do. Or no, I lied. I'm sorry. I read the hug wrong. They're rushing A. It looks like with a flash out. Do you get annihilated by the Mac 10s? Yes, indeed you will. Jackie and Chemical Burn chiming in with the kill of peace. Low Seal finally gets one in return, but the bomb will go down. That's Lil Dick here. Putting the bomb down. Low Seal with another one. Firehawk, Firehawk. with one. Self Roki with another. It's all on to wait for 1v2. SMG versus the rifles. Stuck on ramp here. Absolutely right. Low HP as well. Ooh. That's Low Seal from the short position to secure a second. Four, all good. Good take, sight take. Weren't ready for the flank, it looks like. So, good job by CTs on the retake. And it is important to note that we've got subs, and also this is preseason, so these rosters aren't exactly solidified yet, but of course, everyone trying their best here, no doubt. Oh, yeah themselves an early spot on the team or just you know get those preseason stats looking nice he's buying into it rifles only one smg util life though so we'll see what they can do what can they do indeed brokey lining up this flash going to be flashing in i believe that was firehawk over on the b ramp there. And you see more action. Brokey gonna get one. Slipped it gone on the ramp. And now Wakeful gonna get eliminated in the smoke. That's Alk. Two wise for that sneak. And it looks they're also with another. Yeah, all on to Mickwick here. Does have the bomb, does have a smoke, a flash, and a nade. Elixir and Salt Brokey lower. So. There is potential here to try and do something. Of course, it would have to be monumental. A minute left on the clock. I Make believe. Sense. Yeah, we'll have to. I mean, look, there's always a possibility. Setting up the flash. Gonna swing wide. Yeah, they double peek. You guys oh. can't make the adjustment. Guts damage, though. So it was a very good effort from Mickwick, but all good. Looking all good so far in these first three rounds. Did 50 damage, but just couldn't quite get it. Understandable, though. Looks like T's are doing a half buy into it. One SMG, a Tech 9, P250, Dooley's. I don't need to tell, maybe another rush somewhere? We'll see. That is a possibility. You mentioned mid earlier on in this game, just a couple of rounds ago. Will they decide to do that now? At least a couple of them. Oh, little dick getting but. taken low. Six HP off of that nade. And chemical burn gonna be the first to fall. That's three more going down on the B site. Brokey holding firm. Alk as well with two in the round. And Jack Act left yes, alone no. here. Kind of falling flat on this T side so far. Understandable though. I feel like. Every time I ever play Vertigo, T side is always really rough for me. But then again, I never play it, so kind of hard to really find a rhythm on T side, especially if the T's get that first round. You just kind of feel like you're at an instant disadvantage. Yeah, you have to. I I mean, <laughs> look, I call this map Vertigo garbage. Me personally, I, I don't like it whatsoever. I totally agree with you. It can feel Suffocating on the T side. Jackie getting some damage onto an unsuspecting low seal. Of course, we don't really expect anything to happen. Here, but 
Jack, you're trying to make it look good. A flying Mac 10 kill. But yeah, team off with four rounds. And like you said, just kind of stifling out these hits so far can be a little tough to get going. And preseason too, you know, you're still trying to get used to the new team and everything like that. And everybody getting to know each other. So it's not completely Definitely. terrible for the uh, UPS side just yet, though. But they will need to post around here soon. Seal. See? Oh. Ooh. Almost Ooh. dropping that off off the map. Oh man, look at that A utility. A Ram players just getting dinked down. Look at that chemical burn. Jack, Little Dick all low. Nickel also taking damage. That's headshots for the M4s. But Elixir can be the first one through that smoke to get a kill. And just the T's all grouped up here on A. It is the A hit. Alk holding. Just for the right timing. Besides the swing, it's the from Elixir. But Jackie with two. Potentially opening up this site for now. The bomb will go down. As another player for DPS goes down. And again, a 1vx situation. Wakeful on this op. There is potential. Plenty of time left on the bomb for these remaining two CTs. Going cat. Oh, and Brokey right got him. Cat. There it is. And it's a fifth secured for all good. Got that. That was around. round. Like maybe some players were flash on ramp and stood in the mall a bit too long. Then eight and eight was kind of difficult to recover when you instantly get four players down into 50 HP right at the start of your attack. So let's see if they can do something here. They're going to change up or what they're going to do. We'll see indeed and the change up seems to be a little bit of aggression towards B. That's not going to work out over on the other side of the map. Elixir Another kill A. Oh my goodness, this utility just raining in on the A site. Two players down already on the side of UPS. And the remaining players are damaged well below these headshot ranges for these M4s left on the CT side. Of course, Brokey has an AK, so it doesn't really matter too much there, but unfortunately not a whole lot getting done in the first six rounds so far here on the Vertigo, unless these remaining players for UPS can get something done. They've got utility, so they can set up and execute with three players remaining. Loki trying to stand through the wall, getting a little antsy here, saying, come on, There's some awesome. action here, yeah. I'm telling you where I'm at, wakeful, Firehawk. getting a little bit of damage, but yeah, that's, angle's too good for Firehawk. Gets that kill and it just kind of stalls out here for UPS. All good has been doing fantastic with their CT side utility, so good on them. They've just constantly been chipping away every single round with a picture perfect piece of util. And that's making it so hard because you're instantly at that disadvantage, just going, oh crap, I can't as confidently take this peak because. I'm gonna die if I do, so. Are they trying to save or? I'm not really sure, yeah. I mean, don't die after you die. Stay alive, stay alive. All right, Mickwick does get two, making it a little bit costly for all good, but still, I mean, just straight up domination so far. Even hunting at the end. Yeah. Positive thing for Mickwick seems that they didn't even have to buy any util, so they died after time, but they're still full belt, everything. 6 out to start. I'm sure getting a little nervous here. Oh, good shot by Wakeful. Yes, indeed. Great shot to open it up, and yet again, a relatively kind of early advantage, you could say, for the CT side, and it's they're pushing that advantage even farther. Look at that beautiful bird going down. Wakeful, I believe, dropping off the map. Unfortunately, 
can't get that kill. Jackie, Jackie with though. two. Firehawk to immediately pull any of the damage that may have happened because of Jackie back, and it's a seventh round for all good. Unfortunate overflip there. But what are they gonna do? Their money is looking pretty iffy. Looks like maybe going for another half buy sort of thing. Mac 10, two Mac 10s, Tech 9, Dooley's again. I don't think loves those duelies, I guess. Certainly does. Can you get something done with them, though? Uh, I don't know. Is my HUD correct there? Zero and seven? Maybe uh, Maybe this first kill will be here on the duelies, but Elixir, again, the first person to jump in here on Vertigo. Of course, everybody's popping off, but Elixir specifically, 10 and 3, also low seal, 7 and 1. Firehawk gonna get one and jumping back has to reload. That's me seal with the assist. Instead, Chemical Burn gonna get one, but it's looking like that is all they will get in the round. As Chemical Burn has to run away with the bomb and a Mac 10. No utility left. Firehawk and... really wants this, Zeus. <laughs> in the spirit of Rai and everybody else who loves their Zeus, Firehawk. I mean, here mid, you love to see them. Do you really blame them? It's it's so much fun. It's so satisfying when you do finally get that Zeus kill. Oh yeah, I anybody that pulls out a Zeus, especially when you're winning, seven zero, and you're just chilling here. Oh, chemical burn. Are you gonna eight, creep around eight, closely? Eight, eight, oh, eight, 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 eight. yeah! Oh, we got it. We got a Zeus eight. kill. Eight rounds in. You'll love to see it. Courtesy of Firehawk, our fellow media team member, putting on a strong showing here on Vertigo, eight and six currently. Like we said earlier, everybody for all good popping off. Vibes Playing. are so, all good on that side. They're just vibing, it's all good. Chilling. All right, Wakeful with the op. Swinging mid, do they expect Firehawk again close at this angle? It's little bit elsewhere to get a first kill. Wakeful does not get that kill onto Firehawk, who is completely unaware. I'm to go Again, over to and e. Look at that nade damage. Salt broke it instantly. You did 50 damage to two people there. Yeah, and look at the result of it. Firehawk with two easy kills. Jackie and Little Dick gone. Immediately, any favorable situation that UPS has is just completely wiped out and now they have to creep back towards the A site which has also not been doing that well for them. Wakeful will get a kill elsewhere onto Low Seal. That was mid. If I'm reading the HUD correctly. When's the op battle at least? Mick Mickwick here and Chemical Burn creeping up A and you're right. When will we get that op battle? Currently, Firehawk wielding that weapon. Probably saving it over from Low Seal. And again, Elixir with one. Nickwick will secure the site more or less, but as soon as I say that, that's Firehawk there in the Heavens position. With the op. Sees one. Ooh, we're getting that op battle that you wanted. One ramp, 25 seconds left on the clock. Firehawk repositions towards Catwalk. Alk. Eliminates the other player. That's Mickwick gone. All on to Wakeful. You said you wanted that op duel. Firehawk trying to get it. Ow, there's the bomb. And he's Wakeful running into the smoke. 9-0. and oh, Just complete domination from all good. It's just unfortunate. I feel like... I just feel like UPS needs to stop instant trying to rush into B ramp. Because, man, they are taking so much nade damage every time. And even if they do get a pick, they're instantly double traded out. It's just not working out too well for them. Yeah, and you know, this is one of those scenarios where it's almost like, all right, look, we've gone A a bunch of times and we've gotten naded out. We've gone B a bunch of times, we've gotten naded out. We've gone mid a bunch of times, we've gotten naded out. We're actually just getting out user. Jackie with a first initial kill onto Elixir and Alk also gone. You could say this is the most favorable round that you can have so far. Trying to push that 
good advantage, but that's not going to happen. Nickwick and Wakeful with one each in the elevator. It's all on to Firehawk here. On this top down position, one to oh. four, not going to happen. And UPS secure around finally here on round 10. Finally. It's, it felt like that round, a big part of the success to it was they didn't instantly all take 30 damage from nades right at the start. They got their picks, and I, I'm sure everyone saw the util differences that were highlighted there. It was almost no util damage on the T's, and then I think pretty much everyone over 100 on CT except maybe one. So it makes it a lot easier in that case. When you're, when you're not starting the round, you know, half health because of all these nades before you even get a contact, before you even see somebody, but as soon as we give them some praise, UPS right away to their old ways. Oh. Wakeful gone out of the round already. And here we are, a minute, 20 seconds left in the round, and it just kind of goes quiet. Again, they're, they're just stalled out here in B, outside of B, that is. Chemical Burn trying to see if anybody will creep onto the catwalk. Little dick here, like running up, sees one on headshot, that's Salt Brokey going to take him out. Do they still creep up here, though, is the question. And Jackie thinks better of it. Looks like they decide they will end up going maybe mid or A. Looks like the bomb is creeping up towards mid, so that will be the end result for the UPS with 40 seconds left on the clock, so... Trying to see, maybe, I don't know, let's just go mid and we'll find the pass, path of least resistance, something like that. Flash goes out. Oh, no, that's not a flash. Is that smoke? Smoke goes out. To give them some cover. That's a great entry onto Firehawk. Clearing some space. And Mikwik with another. Right. Interesting that they still oh, choose to Jackie. go B, but it merits some great results. Yes, they have to. One. You're absolutely right, though. You have to expect another Brokey here. Gone. 2v1. Both headshot. players. Yep, you're absolutely right. Both within headshot range. Out. Swings out, about to throw an aid, and Chemical Burn will secure a second here for UPS. Can they mount a third? Sure, they're certainly hoping. Looks like the all goods buy is going to be a little weak. They do have an op and one rifle, but three of them have only a single piece of util. That can make things a little awkward if we don't get a fast pick. So we'll see. Yeah, it, interesting. Despite the sheer domination of this half so far, the buy looks great for all good on the last round. Wakeful got out. Oh, elixir. Also with a great hold. There's more running up here. Wakeful with another op kill. There's great damage coming out of elixir. Tries to throw the ball out. It just doesn't work, unfortunately, before the bomb goes down. Kills across the board, though, but it's happening in the CT's favor. There's only one left. It's Wakeful on the top here on ramp gets run down by the two SMGs and that's 10-2 here on Vertigo for the first half. All good, just domination and they're chilling, aren't they? Yeah, they are. But this is the harder half coming up. T side is a bit weird. That being said, I know Salt Brokey was on Sav, what was it? Two, three seasons ago when they won Recruit and their team was great on Vertigo, so I'm sure they've got plenty of ideas on how they want to play T side here so we'll see what happens we'll have to see if we get the old classic recruit strat out run with a bunch of pistols and a bunch of decoys up to A throw them out immediately run back B that's one of my favorite vertigo strats that is my requested vertigo strat every single time you know it's the only strat I actually like on vertigo I'll be honest all the other ones are just I mean I don't know are they really strats it's just kind of like run around and hope we get picked somewhere and as soon as the round starts you just got to be quiet but low seal already chiming in in this round kills go off on this a site 
bomb goes down. It's looking like a severe advantage for... Oh, good. Look at that. 1v4 already. Mickwick all the way on B site. Just nothing to do. No kit. There's armor, but 39 HP. You're kind of hoping to just... Yeah, well, you were hoping to save the armor, but not even that at that point. Now you're down. Yes. 211. That is unfortunate. They've got a long road ahead of them now. They better hope they can get something here. Looks like they're playing for OT. Safe, full safe here across the board. Either that or they have a great round. Hopefully they do. Always yeah. love a... A pistol eco. A full save against rifles. It would certainly be the way to come back into this map, but... Firehawk says no. Double Already he kills three on the map ten. Four farming the money. Give him the eco ace. Come on. There it is. Ah. Firehawk is it? Oh, what's the ace? Let's go. It's an eco ace. Feels good. You love to see it. And jumps off the balcony at the end there too. Celebrating the eco ace. Farming up the money. Farming up the rounds. 12 to 2. Is there anything for UPS in this map on Vertigo? You need it right here, right now. Mickwick chooses uh, utility over a gun. No gun, Mickwick. Question mark on this last round. He's got 2100. He's not by a gun. Either way, it doesn't matter. Chemical burn with one. Mickwick with a pistol Mickwick kill. Mickwick kill. Yeah, at least he got one. Can you get another? Come on, Mickwick. We believe oh, in you. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> There it is! It's it's forever. Oh, and a third! And it's a third kill! Mickwick! Oh my god. And a USP didn't buy a gun, clearly didn't need to. Securing a third round. Wow. Uh, that, frankly, that should not have worked, but no complaints. You just take those, right? Yep. That's one of those ones that should, uh, yeah, I, uh, <clears throat> I totally meant to do that. All right, totally, absolutely. I'm just that good, that's all. Exactly, that's that's what it is. Just that good indeed. Now we'll have to see how good can UPS make it. Can they get any more rounds or will all good immediately reply? Alk already with an entry onto A. That's the Yaki's on. That's one of the top performers. For UPS. Alk spots the player on the catwalk. That's Lil Dick. Can't get him. Alk removed lots from damage. the round. But you're right. Lots of damage. 19 HP. Firehawk making some noise. Jumping here. Trying to get the boost up. But not going to see anybody. Mickwick close here. Behind that wood panel. No yeah, doubt. Here's all of this. Yeah. Do they throw the utility to clear them out? Do they just clear in general? Oh, they're they spamming. Oh. Very low. The only player remaining, and that's some great entries mm -hmm. onto the B site to secure a 13-3 victory for all good. The brand new franchise coming out here and recruit, showing some domination here in the preseason. Sure, they love that feeling starting off 1 0. They still got one more game tonight, and I'm sure they're hoping for another win there. But that was a very clear, easy win for them. Just unfortunate for UPS, just could not do anything.